Hi guys. Today we will discuss Laravel Artisan console commands. Artisan is the command line interface included with Laravel. It provides a number of helpful commands that can assist you while you build your application. We will see how we can build our own custom commands. Here is a new Laravel project. I did not touch anything yet. To see a list of all available artisan commands. We will use the php artisan list command. Here are all the artisan commands. Every command also includes a help screen which displays and describes the command's available arguments and options. To see a help screen, proceed the name of the command with help. Here we will see the help screen of the migration command. Let's run the command. All right. Here is the description of this command. And this is the command name. And this is the argument. That means we need to provide a name to create our migration file. I hope all of you know about this simple thing. Today I will not go through any commands. But we will create our own command. Let's see make command. This command will create a new artisan command. We will create an artisan command which will add a new user to our users table. Let's run the command. All right. Now open our newly created add user.php file. Let's see the artisan command list again. Here is our new artisan command. This is the description. Now let's modify the add user command class. Change the signature property. Change the description. When we run the command, this handle method will be invoked. Let's output some text through this method. Info method will return some green color text. Here is our info message. Now let's output text through some other methods. The warn method will show yellow text. The error method will show red text. The line method will show white text. Run the command again. Basically, we will add a new user to our database through the handle method. We are using the model factory to create a new user. Return the name of the newly created user. First run migrate command to create our database. Now run our own artisan command to create a new user. Congrats, our new user has been created successfully. Check the database. Here is the new user. Now we will change the process a bit in a different way. We will add some arguments, so that you will have to provide some parameters to create a new user. Add some name and email within the curly bracket. We are getting the name and email through the argument method.
We will put this block of code within try catch so that we can see any errors. Run the command with help. We can see that our command now requires two arguments. Name and email. Now run the command with name and email parameters. We have created our new user with name and email. Now run the same command again. We got an error for duplicate entry of email address. Now we will go deeper. We will ask the user to input the name, email and password. Also ask for a confirmation to proceed or not. First of all remove name and email arguments. We will use the ask method. This method will ask the user to input some text. Let's see this first. Run the command without any parameters. We have to input the name of the new user. For password, we are using the secret method. When the user inputs some text, the terminal will not show that text. Now we will use the confirm method. This will take confirmation from the user. Replace name, email and password. Now run the command. I am providing password 123456. By pressing Y, we have created our new user. Let's run the command again. This time by pressing N, we have cancelled to create the user. Now we will discuss another interesting topic. Sometimes you will need to run artisan commands programmatically. To make it clear, open the web.php file. We will use Arison facades. Within the call method pass the command signature. Don't forget to use artisan facades. Now comment these lines. And uncomment these lines. Run the server. Let's open our project on the browser. Reload the page. Check the database. We have created a new user. Reload the page again. Check the database. Yes, we have created another new user. So guys, hopefully you have enjoyed this video and learned important things about Laravel Artisan Console command. So, please subscribe to my channel and if you face any problem to create your own artisan command, you can make a comment on comment section. I always try to answer the questions. So, thank you again and see you in the next video.